such a long time since I have uploaded on here and I do want to apologize to you guys for just being so inconsistent with my content I just have a lot going on right now um, YouTube is not my only job I do have the two other jobs um, so it's you know I'm trying my best to kind of balance and maintain YouTube social media and then my other jobs um, but if you guys would just bear with me, I'm trying my best to just be as consistent as possible and push out as much content um, as possible. But I do have a video for you guys today. Oh my god. You know what? I'm filming in my room right now and the window's closed and it's like 89 degrees right now and I am burning up. And as you guys can see, I do not have any makeup on today because today is not a makeup tutorial. Today is a hair review slash hair tutorial on the hair that I'm wearing right now. I will leave all the specs on this hair down below in the description box. I do have a discount code for you guys as well, so I will leave that in the description box too. And then I'm going to show you guys in the second part of this video of how I do a half up, half down on a wig. I've never seen it done before, so I'm about to show you guys how I do my half up, half down. You guys have no idea, like this wig is amazing. I got this hair installed a couple days ago and I have just been getting compliments left and right. Like I was actually leaving, um, getting my eyebrows done and there was like a lady police cop who was like driving or whatever and she like stops in the middle of traffic and is like asking me questions like, hey, excuse me, like, um, what do you have it like what kind of hair are you wearing and first off bitch that's rude as fuck you don't ask a, a black woman at that what kind of hair you have just right off top but you know I'm cool I wasn't even tripping um but she was like yeah like what kind of hair do you have in and I told her or whatever and she was like that hair looks so bomb and she was like is that she was like is that a weave or is that a wig and I was like that's it's a wig and she was like it does not even look like a wig or everybody thinks it's my hair and you know what what I do love most about this hair is that it's very lightweight most times when you're wearing curly hair it can be pretty heavy and for this to be 150% density it's very 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 lightweight like I don't even feel like I have anything on my head. If Summertime had a wig, a curly wig, it would be this wig. Okay. If anybody knows, y'all, like if y'all wear weaves and wigs and all that, y'all will know that curly hair is the most high maintenance hair ever. Like, you can't, like, with straight hair, you can wrap it and at night and wake up and kind of just touch it up a little bit and you're out the door. But when you have a curly hair, when you have a curly weave or a curly wig, you have to, like, work on that hair you know what I mean like you can't just like get up and walk out the door that's not how it works this hair does not tangle guys and this is so weird because it's curly hair and I'm just like what the heck like how do you not tangle like that's just weird to me like all curly I have had a lot of curly wigs in my lifetime <laughs> In my lifetime every single one of them has tangled has gotten matted at one point or another and this wig like I don't know what they did to this hair just made it so freaking perfect and special and all that because I literally have no problems with this wig at all so this is how the hair looks let me just get into the camera this is the curl pattern it's so pretty. It's just like a very natural, loose, curly wave, and you don't really have to do much to it. Like, it's so pretty. So, so, so pretty. This is how it looks in the back. Enough of me ranting about this wave. Let me just get right into the tutorial on. Okay, so I'm going to first start off by pulling all of my hair back into a ponytail or whatever I'm going to pull in the ponytail. I'm going to pull that up now. And I'm going to just have a little bit of, um, I'm going to have like the little hairs on the sides. Just kind of leave those out to give it a more natural look. You feel me? So I'm just going to pull that into a 
ponytail I didn't this is kind of like a messy kind of tutorial I didn't like use a rat tooth comb to part or anything like that this is just a quick and easy tutorial on you know actually leaving it like that would have been like really cute too but uh, yeah so after I get a ponytail I'm just gonna twist it this is super easy I'm just gonna twist it um, and then I'm gonna pin it using bobby pins and then that's pretty much it and then for my baby hairs, I use a uh, cream of nature, cream of nature. I'm probably saying this wrong, but it's, um, it's style and shine foaming mousse. And I feel like this is probably the best for baby hairs because it lays it down and slicks it all together without making it hard. And you know, it's, it's, it's easy, simple, and it smells really good and it doesn't leave it hard. So that's why I fuck with it. But yeah, that's pretty much it to this tutorial, this half up, half down. So you can do half up, half down with the wig. And I hope you guys learned a lot and I will see you guys soon. Make sure to thumbs up and subscribe and all of that. And I love you guys. And I'll see you guys next time.